Hello everyone, hoping that all of you are well and taking care of yourself. Myself, Vineet Khatri and this video will be a game changer for all the students who are preparing for BITSAT 2025. I will be discussing about all the various aspects of the BITSAT exam like the latest exam pattern, eligibility criteria, the cutoff, the campuses which accept this score, scholarship and much more. All the aspects will be covered in detail in this particular session. So before moving ahead, firstly, make sure you hit the like button right now. Okay, so let us start without wasting any time of yours. What are the colleges? What are the main campuses, you know, which accept the BITSAT score? BITS Pilani has many campuses, even they have the campus abroad as well in Dubai, right? They have the campus in Mumbai as well. But for the UG courses, we have three campuses, right? The main campus, the OG campus, is BITS Pilani, right? The most preferred one. Apart from that, we have BITS Goa, right? We have BITS Hyderabad as well. These are the three campuses in which you will be going. So which is your dream campus out of these three? Tell me in the comment section for sure. Which is your dream campus and why? Why do you want to do that? Because you know, that brings a lot of conviction in you that why you really want to do that. That, that is very important. Now, the next thing that what is BITS at? What is this, this examination? This is the, actually the main building of BITS Pilani, right? So, similarly, uh, very simply, BITSAT is an online entrance exam conducted by BITS Pilani. Obviously, it's, a, it's an entrance exam and uh, it is for admission to B, B Pharma and MSc programs at Pilani, Goa and Hyderabad campus. And how many students give this exam? Around 3 lakh. Normally, around 3 to 4 lakh students give BITS Pilani, uh, they give BITSAT examination. And normally the number of seats are around three to four thousand, right? So as you can see, the ratio of selection is not very high. But what we can see is majority of the students who give this exam are not specifically preparing for BITSAT. They are primarily preparing for, yes, they are primarily preparing for ITJ, J Main, and as well as J Advanced, right? So that's why in that sense, BITSAT exam has less competition because um, you can imagine out of three lakh, very few students, like 30, 40 thousand students would be exclusively focusing on the BITSAT. In that case, you will see that the selection ratio can be very, very high, right? So, now let me tell you about the next important thing that what is the cutoff of BITS Pilani, right? The last year cutoff for BITS Pilani is for various branch, for example, uh, chemical, civil, mechanical, computer science. For example, the total marks which you can score is 390, right? And with bonus questions, you can score practically, uh, theoretically even more score. but this is the cutoff 327 and no reservations are there directly right in uh, category wise or you can say on the basis of caste or category there are no reservations so the cutoff is 327 for uh, computer science but for other branches like civil uh, chemical the, you can see the cutoff is 238 for b pharma the cutoff is quite low uh, b pharma student normally don't prefer much right so you can see uh, for the major branches if you want to get into bits pilani you have to score at least 238 right out of 390 and which is a decent score it's not a less score because in the very limited highly limited time you have to do so many questions with very high accuracy now moving ahead we have to see what is the exam you know what are the exam dates what is the schedule for the bitsat 2025 now there are many students <clears throat> which are you know confused that whether they should exclusively prepare for bitsat or just focus on je I would advise that you should also start preparing for BITSAT because uh, in BITSAT we have English uh, proficiency as well as logical reasoning, right? And that is very important for selection as well as good rank. Now let's move on with the schedule. The application forms, you know, application forms are there now available for the first session. BITSAT exam is conducted two times in an year, right? So we are talking primarily about the first session right now. So now the application forms are available and they are available till late. It is available, they are available till late. And after that, the bookings, you know, uh, you have to book the slots because there are various slots in which exams uh, will be taken, right? For example, from 26th May to 30th of, 30th of May, your BITSAT 2025 computer-based test, computer-based exam will be there. And in that slot booking would be there, right? So you can book your slots according to your choice and availability as well, right? So these are the various important dates and um, what I'll do is uh, in the description and in the comment, pinned comment, I'll put this PDF. Okay, so don't worry that you have to take the screenshot and all. I'll, I'll share uh, 
the, all the details there in in this that okay in that pdf so you got the point now other major highlights the conducting body obviously is bitspirani the full form of this exam is billa institute of technology and science admission test exam level exam level you already know right it is based out of the if you talk about the syllabus the syllabus is primarily ncert level and uh, normally in various shifts the exam level is you can say approximately little below je main right so now as you can see the mode of application is online but the mode of exam is computer based test uh, for that you have to go to the various centers the center allocated to, uh, to you and on that, that center a computer will be allocated to you and there you have to give your test right and the score will be displayed just after the exam is over right so it is quite interesting because when i gave my test uh, in, uh, in bitsa 20 2005 right very very uh, uh, you know so many years ago so i was shocked to see my score my score was fine but the point is immediately you know you get your score so that that's crazy actually application fee for the boys girls uh, it is given and for both the sessions if somebody register for both the sessions there is some discount as well right uh, so the fee for single session is 3500 but both the session it is 5500 right now the next uh, exam frequency i have already told twice a year exam duration is 3 hours right number of question is 130 questions right isme in this uh, 130 questions there will be only single correct options right uh, only one uh, option is correct out of the four options total seats it is written 2000 but it is approximately around 3000 right uh, now number of exam centers are uh, 61 and uh, official website is given very helpline is given again i am telling you that all the details will be available in the description now very important about bitsat 2025 eligibility criteria so many students are confused about it let me tell about the latest criteria firstly you have to you know uh, you must have passed the 12th standard exam from a recognized board but now which subjects are compulsory you must have physics chemistry and mathematics and apart from that english proficiency is required now what is the minimum marks required in the board examination So in the physics, chemistry, and mathematics aggregate, you must have seventy-five percent. For example, if you have seventy percent in physics and eighty-five percent in chemistry and ninety percent in maths, it works because it is it is more than seventy-five percent. You got the point. But for individual subjects, you have to have at least sixty percent. It means if you have sixty percent in physics, if you have ninety-five percent in chemistry, ninety percent in maths, then it works. but if it is 55 or 59 in physics or 97 in chemistry 99 in maths even then it won't work so you have to get at least 60% marks in the individual subjects uh, in uh, these three pcm right and along with that aggregate you have to have 75% now let's move forward now we have to see the exam pattern what is the bitsat 2025 exam pattern the latest exam pattern it is not changed since many many years see total number of questions which you have is 130 and once you have completed attempted all the 130 questions you will get the bonus questions as well you will get the bonus questions but majority of the students are not able to do that all the 130 questions so it is very difficult for you to get the bonus questions right and uh, now in the physics you have 30 question chemistry you have 30 question but see in the mathematics you have 40 questions right for people for the students who are aspiring for b pharma uh the main thing is biology right they will have biology instead of mathematics apart from these three you will have english proficiency and logical reasoning right in the english proficiency you will have 10 questions and for the logical reasoning you will have 20 questions so as you can see it is a very important section for your you know preparation so along with your j you can start preparing for bitsat 2025 many of the students among you they are planning for bitsat 2025 and i know that many of you want a master resource in which english proficiency is covered logical reasoning is covered along with that bitsat specific practice is given thousands of questions will be solved and uh, you want the specific you know live sessions for that as well so dear students watch this okay so you must have watched this and uh, make sure you take advantage of this particular master resource all the details are given in the description and the pinned comment you can take advantage of that particular course right now let's move forward uh, now let me tell you about the 
very important part that is scholarship because many of the students think that bits pilani is completely unaffordable and all that but let me tell you uh, bits pilani has a very good placements and the average salary packages are very high so uh, you know the fee compensates for all of that you know whatever you invest in that uh, what you get the atmosphere because in bits pilani there is a very good atmosphere of uh, you know there is a startup culture many students go for startup and so many big uh, companies uh, right now are owned by bits pilani alumni right so it's a very good startup culture along with that uh, many people students prepare for upsc and many students go abroad for higher studies as well right so bits pilani has an amazing culture if somebody can take a loan and even study at bits pilani that has surely has a very good value because it's the best private college in the india right uh, now what about the scholarship so according to the institutes merit come uh, you know merit award scheme the top 1% of the students right top 1% will get 100% of total tuition fee uh, will be you know waived off for the top 1% now next two top percent uh, students they will have 40% of total tuition fee so tuition apart from the tuition fee there are many other fee as well they won't be waived off you know for example hostel fee mess fee there are other other fee as well apart from that there is merit come need based scheme as well you know uh, if somebody has low income in the family average income is less for them for the top th three students and top 6% 12% there are different you know uh, schemes of scholarship as well so as you can see the scholarship is quite good if the student is academically quite fine very good and even if uh, they have some problem financial problem then the help is given from the bits pilani as well right so apart from that let us see the placement season 2024 in the placement season it was a challenging year for not just for bits pilani even for the iits as well it was a challenging placement season but many of the students have gone for the you know studying abroad many of the students around 300 students from bits pilani they went abroad for the higher studies you know they are pursuing their ms or mba or various other uh, courses apart from that so many students were there in the btec right for the batch for the be but majority of them majority of them jo hai they were placed most of them were placed and i told you many of them you know pursued this right so you can say most of the students are uh, placed and the median salary offered is this so as you can see the median salary is quite high as compared to the most of the college even it is at par with the top iits right so bits pilani uh, is aspirational and uh, i think most of us should aspire for bits pilani and it is relatively easy as compared to je if you if you are comfortable with english and logical reasoning then you have an advantage so i would surely recommend you if you are planning for bits pilani if you are planning to give for bits at 2025 you need to prepare for it uh, you know along with the je at least prepare for english proficiency and logical reasoning for pcm you mainly have to practice right apart from that the master resource which i have told in the video you can use that as well okay dear students so hoping that this particular video uh, you know helped you in clarification of all the doubts make sure you hit the like button i'll see you in the next particular video regarding regarding the strategy for bitsat 2025 i'll see you in the next video bye bye take care and keep doing well love you all do you know that more than 3 lakh students give bitsat exam every year but most of them don't prepare for bitsat exclusively primarily they prepare for je so if somebody prepares exclusively for bitsat exam they will have great advantage because you know especially in bitsat we have english proficiency logical reasoning which ensures the selection of a student and also ensures a good rank along with that there are many bitsat specific topics as well so for covering all these aspects we have brought a master resource for all of you which is pilani crash course that is pcc which will cover english proficiency and logical reasoning in detail with all the problem solving approach all the important previous year question which are memory based along with 5000 plus questions of physics chemistry and mathematics as well you will have live sessions you will have guidance sessions you will have live doubt solving sessions as well right so all the details of the course are given on our website and all the details are given the link is given in the description and also the pinned comment so make sure you check out our pilani crash course from there and enroll from there all the best